Welcome back. This is Safety Time on Plus TV Africa. Our guests on this episode are Nigerians and all round entertainers Clinton and Blair Roberts. They are motivated and creative individuals who broke into the music scene and officially kicked off their music career after winning the prize for Best Upcoming Teen Artist in the Nigerian Teen Choice Awards in 2013. The duo were officially announced as Mavy Records Artists in February 2017 with a very recent EP, which I must say we are enjoying, titled Gemini. Let's welcome the dynamic duo, GNA. Okay. Hello. Thanks for having us, guys. Welcome to the party. Mm. The pop mm. source words. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for having us. Mm. Appreciate that. Okay, so a little Betty told me that you two are television anchors as well. So, well, mm. yeah, I think I like to say it that way, but mm. the main focus is music. But I yeah. mean, but you do that as well. Yeah, yeah as that's, a hobby. that's another talent and hobby as well. So I mean. Just okay, it. so before we discuss Gemini, yeah. let's shake that side a bit. We want to see you doing your television, anchoring a bit, and basically just you giving us opinions, right? So okay. the topic is something we saw on Twitter. Mm -hmm. A lady says that men don't forgive cheating. Mm -hmm. I'm the only lady here, I'm just realizing. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> what do you think? Hmm. Well, well, do you want to talk? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I can <laughs> Well, to be very, very honest, I think that that's, that's true mm. to an extent. Yeah, to an extent. Yeah, to very we large want extent. to be very, very realistic with ourselves, man. Like, uh, what a woman can take, a man, if she can take it like, if a woman can take it like five times when she finds out that her boyfriend or husband cheated, a man can take it once. Mm, yeah. Not saying that it's good to accept that your boyfriend cheated on you. I mean, like, I mean, you can um, say whatever you want to say or do whatever you want to do. Yeah. It's your choice. But I mean, it, if we're being realistic, mm -hmm. men find it more difficult to forgive. Why? I, I think it's like a explain why. It's like a it's like a selfish, egoistic mm. type. Yeah, I like the words thing. you're using. Selfish, egoistic. It's, it's the it means there is a problem. <laughs> it's the truth. It's mm. the truth. But like at the same time, like. It is what it is, man. <laughs> it I saw is to, what it is. To just um, buttress this point, I saw one of the comments on the story, and the girl said, yes, yeah, so this, that's the reason why I'm single right now. He cheated on me, I cheated on him back, and he broke up with me. So that's to show you that we can't take it, like we can't mm. stand it. Especially when you make us know. It's better I don't know about it, but you know, when you do it and then you make it obvious, it's hard to forgive because you know what it feels like to know that another man is sharing out of the... Hi, you know, yeah, but I think it's, it's it's also like different. Like if if like there's like a mutual understanding that like, you know what this is an open relationship. Yeah. We love each other, we like each other, but I mean, you could still like explore a scene for which, now that we're not which, married which and all that stuff, which is hard. Was, but yeah. I mean, like just don't tell me, but do you, man? Do what you gotta do. If it's if that's like the deal in a relationship, because there are some relationships that are set that way. I mean, Since you are open are, to such relationship, but you are it. Well, I, I really don't know what type of relationship that is. <laughs> Open relationship. <laughs> no, man, like, I'm not, I'm not really down for that. Man. Mm. It doesn't make any sense yeah. to me. Okay, let's not make this a relationship conversation. Let's move yeah, on to life. the EP. Yeah, right? Yeah. Gemini. Gemini EP is mm. the reason for the yeah. season. For the season. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, Gemini EP is like the hottest EP in the world right now. Mm. Take it or leave it. Yeah, okay. Cool. You get me? Because like the EP is Periods. Like, yeah, yeah, man, periods. <laughs> yeah, like, <laughs> yeah, man, I did, I did, I did. Like, so it's, it's, uh, it's a combination of like our hard work, smart work, and like our teamwork from our team and friends and, you know, colleagues and people like that believe in us and all that stuff and it's just like the volume one yeah mm. you know it's just four songs mm. right and the volume two is still gonna come out but right now the focus is this volume one and it just gemini in in the real sense of it like just explains the fact that you know you have like sp split pers personalities mm -hmm. and we have like two different like um approaches sounds and to approaches sound. to like a song right really that we merge as one to make one wow. okay so, so yeah I discovered that there's a new feel to this DNA in Gemini, like, mm -hmm. and you guys went away for like a year. And well, less than a year. Though. Less than a so year. You got something close to a year. You went, not yeah. like you went away, but you were MIA for a bit. Yeah. People were wondering yeah. where you guys were. So are you saying that this was the sound you've been working on for over a year to create, or 
this is just something that just came up. It's just, it's just the tip. This is just the tip of the iceberg. <laughs> so would you say you have found your sound and we should expect more of this type of vibe? Well, to be honest, Shoshin, man, we, we learn every yeah, day. We learn so every day. day. No, man, like, we love to explore. We keep, that's that's it's just getting yeah, better. Man. And yeah, so you could hear different sounds more. And it's still DNA. Because that's you get what me. we do. Our yeah. sound is literally what we give. What we feel like when we want to record as at the time of recording. So you said this is volume one. How yeah. far are we going? How far? Yeah. Volume yeah. ten. Go, <laughs> <laughs> go, go. No, no, no. no. Mm -hmm. It'll just probably be volume two or volume three. Okay. Yeah. And the next one probably might be like an album, an album. or, you know. Yeah, because it's high time, man. It is, man. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's high time. Mm -hmm. it's high time. So what would you want your fans? I mean, whether you went to MIA for a few months or a year, I'm sure there are people who have been following to see what is going on with DNA. Mm -hmm. Actually, with the fact that there are people in Mavens, I mean, you have Johnny Drill, Ladipo, mm -hmm. and they've been yeah. dropping songs, right? Mm -hmm. And we've been looking and watching what's happening to this guy. So what would you want this EP to do for your person or how do you how do i make it pure now <laughs> <laughs> for, for, your, for, the group. for your people's yeah <laughs> well, 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 well to be very honest like first of all in maven records we have like a whole lot of talented acts mm. right like you know every every single person like Simon Malibu, even to the staff is talented man like mm. it's like a rotation of talent everywhere you yeah. get me so like it's 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 we're in that space where we just had to you know take our time you know, to step do step back a little, step back and make sure know, we focus. come out with delays not solid. Denial, do you mm. get me? So yeah. we have we have to always like make sure that whatever we're coming out with is worth it. It's worth the wait. It's worth the while. Yeah, at least me? that's that's what our fans deserve. Yeah, so for, it's yeah. it's a, it's like a healthy competition because when you see people like Johnny Drill, see people like Rema, see people like Crayon, see people like DJ, you get me? Like you're gingered always like to always, you know step it up at, at every point so yeah I like so that's, speaking that's of gemini um personally i like kayama mm -hmm. i like um thank you um what's it called again wanting more wanting more, wanting more. yeah so what's your personal favorite and what's yours my personal favorite is wanting more that's it man says <laughs> okay. yes, chop life man live life enjoy man if you love me or you don't still just be happy, man. You get me. So okay, that's so it. So I really. get this vibe like you are the top life gang guy. And he's, <laughs> <laughs> he's, 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 he's like he's like laid back. I don't like, just follow him. Tag so along. Like, right? like, like nah, he's laid back. So I, I wouldn't want to call it a tag along. There's something that's no, no, it's, it's like no, the, it's like the, it's the, the DNA, it's the intertwined thing. So there's one thing that is public knowledge. We know you both can resist women. Oh, because wow. we saw your food snack challenge. Okay. Oh, yeah. we, oh, we, wow. <laughs> we saw that. We know you can be. But what's the difference in your personalities? Um, I don't know, man. I just say I'm I'm a little bit more like laid back, calculated. I like to like I don't just yeah. But him, he's a crazy crazy guy. Just <laughs> no, no, no. You, you, you leave that. I, I like to, I like to speak. I like to speak for myself yeah. at this point because like <laughs> <laughs> you know Slimmer. yeah. I, no, I, I actually accept that i'm like the crazy type right but like i'm crazy when it's worth it and when like at the right times like you know we always like what well, I, I learned to I, like i always want to speak out my mind like say it as it is like what it is and you know, always hit it on the on the head like no hanky panky i like to have fun as well and funny enough the thing is that we we switch personalities, switch personalities. sometimes, oh, wow. you know. So like, I could wake up tomorrow and I'm the quiet, laid back guy, and yeah. this guy is the and ginger owner. Yeah. He's like, yo, what's yeah. going on? So and like, then six months later, we switch again. Yeah. Yeah. Like it's, yeah. it's crazy. It's, it's so really we, we don't we don't even know how it happens. It's not planned, but it just happens. So. Does that happen with the music? Mm. Yeah, yeah, I was going. I was going to ask if, that's, if there's going to ever be a time no. where we still know there's a DNA, but mm -hmm. you might want to have like a solo song, and you have a solo song, mm. and you know, would that ever happen? For now, for now that is right, not man. like the the thing. We're, we're on a mission. We're on a mission to take over the world. Focus, 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 Nice one, nice one. <laughs> but we killed the brain, they were cool, actually. Yeah, they were cool. Yeah. Yeah. They didn't achieve much, but they had good <laughs> No, no, no. It's, it's they had good plans. For DNA, know? for DNA, it's like a submission to, it's not just about saying, take, 
take over the world. Mm. It's about actually taking, taking over the over world, yeah, man. right? In the positive way and sh sharing like positivity to Through people. Our music. And, you know, the DNA V slogan, which means like, you know what, you know what you want, you know who you are, and you go, go for it. it. Mm -hmm. Go get it. And that's, that's Never give are, up. Man. No matter what, no matter how hard, no matter how, no matter what life throws at you, keep going, keep going. That's, that's what we're all about. That's and the and we're here to inspire the world, man. Background or let's let's use upbringing now. Yeah. Say your upbringing defines who you are. So how would you say um, Mavens is like a family to you guys, and mm -hmm. the upbringing matters as well. The leader of the team as well is also very important. And from the outside, because I'm not inside, I mm -hmm. can see I know for facts <laughs> yeah. that Don Jazzy is quite visionary. We saw him do what he did with Moit and then, um, now with Mavens. So how would you say that his influence has affected your music? And being with all those talented guys. Mm. Just that you. Yeah, man. <laughs> Don Jazzy, Don Jazzy's um, leadership is actually top notch, like from our perspective. Because, I mean, like over the years, there's a lot we've learned from him, um, um, music wise, life wise, different things that you can't pay for. Do you understand? Like, you can't easily just get from just being with like anybody. Do you understand? There's there's so many things we've we've learned from him, and to be honest, he's he's been a great influence on our lives, on uh, our music and our sound as well. Cause, I mean, he's he's done a lot. It's, I can't even start saying. I can't even start. And we we, we trust we trust him. We trust what like the vision he has seen, and and that's why we're. I see they go fronts like this with the whole arm for back. You get me? So, because we trust it, we trust it. He's done it before and he's still going to do it again, like with the grace of God on his head. So, I mean. Okay, so moving it away from <coughs> Don Jazzy now. Yeah. So, for yourselves, would you say you are studying the industry? Because that's going to be my next question. Are you studying the industry for yourself? Every day. We, okay. we, we are still studying the industry, but so far we have studied the industry. Okay, to be honest, so, so I'm taking it to the whole list that is dropping now. It's weird that we're having lists, so much list in June when it's not December yet. Mm -hmm. More like everybody's done with 2020. Yeah. Well, we had the list from Billboard, and yesterday we had another list from um, a platform that decided to collate YouTube views. Mm -hmm. And the list was um, surprising for some, especially when you're seeing someone like Techno at number two, and the people that you think they would make one and two were not the ones on one and two. And Sinatch. You know Sinatch and all that. So for your personalities now, have you decided to say you want a bit of controversy in your career or you just want to be talented and focused in your music when it comes to showbiz right now? We just want to be real. We just want to be real. So real comes if, if Yeah, if real comes with a little bit of yeah, controversy, yeah, I mean, man. Like, we might just go, go ahead and just be ourselves and do what we have to do. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? Because, I mean, in my own opinion, no publicity is bad publicity, but I mean, it's not like we're trying to get into like bad publicity, bad publicity. But we try as much as possible not to. Yeah, we try to be good boys, but it's like the bad boys in us keep like. Coming out. Cool. Okay, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> So okay. what is the first thing you guys are going to do when this whole corona thing is over and then the entertainment venues are all open hmm. again? We're going to throw a party. Goes, hmm. What? We're going We're to throw a party. <laughs> <this> party <laughs> for our fans, our DNA fans. A party. It's going to be so huge. We're going to invite so many people and we're going to have the best time. Yeah, man, ever. just, just have fun, just man. Like, I feel like- You just sounded like you are starving what, 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 the fun. What yeah. have you yeah. missed yeah. exactly? Life. Have you missed parties or have you missed being- Clearly has, look at what you said. Yes, 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 yes. I've missed parties. Because we have like a yearly party we do. Uh, well. Our own so, personal party. You know, we we're supposed to do it in Easter, but because of the corona thing and mm. everything, we had to like pause it to December. Hopefully like, it's over before then, man. <laughs> we do it, man. We miss- affected finances. For you guys, whoa, yeah. it's crazy. It's you, not just you never for, your, it's you not never just for us. I think, it's for, <laughs> I think it's for everybody. <laughs> I think it's for everybody and in every industry, <laughs> every actually, because like it's it's crazy. But you just have to keep pushing, man. You have to do what you have to do. Corona or no corona, man. Like, cause Life right now this gone. is like the new normal. So if you mm -hmm. cannot devise a way to stay to safe and still get past it, go get what you want mm -hmm. and what you need. Right then, you're sleeping on a bicycle, yeah, or in a motorcycle. Yeah. If for a reason the world goes deaf and there was no music anymore, what would you guys do? Pass out. I'll go ah. deaf with. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we need to sing or freestyle because our time is always up. But All right. All right. what would you be doing for us? Hmm. What are we going to? What you want to? Time flies. 
Time flies, girls fly. You just pass by me today. You said you love me there, and I knew that you lied. I just stood by, trying to believe what your friends all said. Yeah, I still have to baby. You said you'd be my one and only. Hey. Okay. Yeah, the voice DNA just, just came through. Okay, that, that's, that's, that's beautiful. Thank you very much. I feel like I want another one. Ah, nah, nah. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is absolutely Thank beautiful. So nice. Thanks. Appreciate that. Okay, that's how we wrap up. Daffy. Thank you for drinking tea with us today. It was a lit one. Thank you so much for having me. It's great. Really nice and definitely, well. please do check out Gemini. It's an amazing EP. Like he said, well, he said he's the best in the world. So go you stream, go stream, go stream, and let us know if he's the best in the world. Okay. Thank you for watching, and do send your opinions via WhatsApp to zero nine zero six thousand five seven one nine or Twitter to us at Plus TV Africa. My thank you as usual goes to Michael Anko Ifeoli Washunke, our guest DNA, and the entire production team. My name is Elsie Godwin. Keep watching Plus TV Africa.